it is my great pleasure to address my co-bankers, co-operators in the field that now the time has changed that as we are changing with the technology, our uh, risks are also changing. Earlier, we used to say that we do not have credit expertise. We have got a credit risk that should be considered, that should be assessed properly. Then the survival of the cooperative banking is there. But now the time has changed. With the figures, it has been proved last n number of years and recently also that there is no much credit risk to the cooperative sector because basically the credit is a consideration and an assessment on the personal relations which is a core of the banking in a cooperative sector. There is a greater credit risk in the private sector bank and much more even than that in the public sector bank. But in last few years, the figures have revealed that there is no credit risk, but with the change in the technology, it is affecting in the other way around. My opinion is with the change in social media and the social element that are acting in and against the cooperative movement, they are having some different interest in looking at the cooperative sector will be at stake because of this technology failures or say under utilization of the proper technology which is required in the current banking scenario. But I am happy to say that all the cooperative bankers have now adequately adopting the technology but in spite of that there are a larger area to have an improvement. But that does not mean that we have lost our area of service. Our area of service is intact. Our credit risk is also intact. But because of the social media and certain little failures on the technology platforms, we are singled out in the banking sector. And that has been a concerns effort and action taken by an element, those who don't want a cooperative sector to be a larger and major player in the Indian banking industry. To face them, as I would like to say, we at the Cosmos had a cyber attack up about 100 crores a year and a half back. That was the worst situation in the history of the Cosmos Bank. So it was told by everyone, those who are not in the cooperative, I specifically say those who are not in the cooperative sector that hence after there will be a risk to the cooperative banking sector and particularly to the Cosmos Bank that it is going to collapse. It will be wound up. But no, my friends, it was the cooperative sector which supported us. And I understand that it was just because of we are banking on the trust. My spread in seven regions supported me. If it would have been at a single region, single state, that would have affected more. But my small cooperative bankers, my younger brothers, my smaller brothers, those who are into the cooperative thing, are now take, should take more interest in protecting their image. The risk of the technology is even less. But the reputation risk is more. Credit risk I am not talking about because I have said that we are good in assessing the credit as far as the cooperative small banks are concerned. Their NPAs are not very sad to say that they are very large in number. But the reputation is at stake. And when such incidents occurs or when there is a rumor or when there is a social media which is working against you, you should take the support of the same media to revert back. As in Cosmos, when there was an attack, what we have done is we have shown and demonstrated what is the trust that the people have in us. Within a very short span of say few days, few weeks, we started an, an attempt and efforts to demonstrate to the public that people have got continuing support with us. Our financials were very strong. But at that point of juncture, the financial strength is not only sufficient. You should go back to the society on the base on the various technology to establish and demonstrate your strength and the trustworthiness. So what we have done, we have taken those who are uh, uh, quite educated and uh, analytical people and those who are leaders in the business 
to demonstrate their trust on the Cosmos Bank in continuing their banking with the Cosmos at various levels, at the branch level, at the regions level. We conducted various seminars. We communicated through a media, through a WhatsApp messaging and all this. What are their views about Cosmos and whether they are continuing with the Cosmos? They said it has nothing to do with the Cosmos and the sustainability and the strength of the Cosmos. But it is a small failure which was unfortunate that it has happened with the Cosmos. But no element from the insider was involved in it and the trust with the bank is continuous. If that we demonstrate properly, others in the banking, those who do not have that capability to assess the strength of the bank believe in them and they continued with us. We are not just, not just done only with our customers, with our uh, say uh, leaders in our uh, uh, sector, but we have shared it with the media also. We come upfront, we were very transparent in stating that it was a, not a technology failure, but it was a high efficiency and the efforts taken by the uh, international hackers that some way or the other, some industry was to affect, some bank was to affect and we were affecting, but that does not affect our strength. We will face the situation, we are strong enough to face the situation and all are with us that we demonstrated. Even the cooperative banking sector was with us, saying that even if we require some money at this point of time, we will not take away any deposits or any banking relation from the cosmos and that has given strength. A cooperation and the trustworthiness should be proved, should be brought on record which only gives the sustainability because only the credit risks are hence after no more a great challenge to the cooperative sector. But with the changing banking scenario, the small size and the, the social media which is working against and for some interest against the cooperative sector, we should protect against it and for that reputation risk should be analyzed. We at the board level should also be strong enough transparent enough, taking into confidence even at our the staff. So, the internal management should be done precisely and timely. We took an uh, serious efforts and uh, meetings of the officers at the various level to make them understand that they are strong enough to face the situation. That is with the HR problem that we have to sort out instantly, but not enough that. We also planned that whatever the requirement of the withdrawal is there, we will meet out instantly without any delay in that and without requesting anyone to not to withdraw the amount. So, we gave them confidence, the bank is stronger, your money is ready, but you should continue with the bank because it is an attack, it is a small attack which will not affect the survival of the bank. So, coming forefront and with the transparently proving our trustworthiness, our clear understanding about the situation and how we are going to overcome it, demonstrating it with the people is the solution in such situation what Cosmos has fed. I hope after this attack, all banking sector, all cooperative banking sector, particularly Reserve Bank of India is taking serious efforts in bringing various advisories and bringing a technology in cooperative sector at part with the others. The security aspects are strengthened, but in spite of that, the reputation risk is a greater risk to be foreseen by the cooperative banking sector. And if that is solved, we will survive irrespective of anything, any challenge coming to the cooperative sector.